Hey YouTube, it's Pokey Dad again, and today I'm just going to do another news report. This one is not real, real important, but there's one card in this uh, set of cards that I'm going to show you that I think could potentially be a game changer. Um, maybe not, maybe I'm exaggerating a little bit, uh, but uh, this is the t the Embor EX versus the Toga Kiss EX deck. This is a set that's going to be released sometime after Ancient Origin, and uh, it's uh, you know already in Japan, or at least the cards are de are shown, and it will be released soon in Japan. Uh, I also already did a video showing the Embor EX and the Toga Kiss EX. Neither one of them were super great. But now we're looking at a few other cards that come in the deck that don't come in, say, uh, that they're special cards just for the decks only. So uh, let's just take a look at a couple of them. Well, we'll I'll briefly run through all of them. None of them are spectacular, except there's one that I think might make a difference. Uh, so Electro Buzz, I'll go ahead and you can see uh, the basic HP 70. Double colors gives you knuckle for 20 damage. Okay, nothing special there. Elect Electivire, stage one to Electro Buzz. Um, again, a double colorless hits for 30. And then a lightning and a double colors hits for 90. Alright, Corsola, Spike Cannon does 30 times damage. Flip two coins. And it's 30 times the number of heads. So for a double colorless, for three colorless, it's got power gem, which hits for 50. It's a water type. All right, now here's the one that is kind of exciting me. Not Esper, but Meowstic. So Esper is the basic of Meowstic. Has an HP of 60 and can do 10 damage. But let's look at Meowstic, because this card, if it's translated correctly, I believe it's going to be potentially pretty good. All right. So there's the artwork. The attack, the second attack, let's look at that first. Size shot, 40 damage for a psychic and a colorless. And it does 40. Okay, so nothing spectacular. But it's this first attack that really um, gets my creative juices flowing. And I hope it'll get your creative juices flowing. In fact, I'd like to see what uh, you think of it in the comments below and particularly how you would use this card so for a colorless energy it has energy gift choose up to two energy cards from your hand and attach them to one of your benched Pokemon alright so it's an energy accelerator All right, I have a few uh, points to make about this and then I'll also tell you give you some ideas of what can get charged up okay the first point is that psychic types do not have very good energy acceleration. The really only form of energy acceleration they have is Dimension Valley, and I wouldn't really call it excel energy acceleration. I would call it more uh, attack cost lowering. Uh, so it can call it allows it's like energy acceleration except that it reduces the cost of the attack which actually comes in play for this card because if we have a Dimension Valley energy gift is now free meaning Meowstic can use this first attack for nothing if Dimension Valley is in play then this first attack is free alright so that's that's really a great point right there secondly choose up to two energy cards now this doesn't say basic energy cards it says two energy cards now we'll have to look at the official translation uh, when you know when it comes out in English but two energy cards how about putting a uh, sorry uh, a rainbow energy on one of your Pokemon. How about a double colorless energy? Putting that on one and then still being able to put a, a basic energy. So let's say 
we wanted to get Trevenant, the psychic type, ready to go. We could put a psychic energy and a double colorless, and next turn it's ready to go. Uh, the one that really excites me, and this is where I'm, where I want to just go ahead and transition and start talking to you about potential Pokemon that can get charged up very fast. What if we used uh, Giratina EX, the Dragon type, from uh, Ancient Origins that's coming out? You could attach a double Dragon energy from your hand and then a double Colorless energy from your hand on one turn. Then the following turn you could attack with Giratina and Giratina would be totally charged up without having to uh, put four energies on there. And with, you know, normally, even if you had to do that with two attachments, that would take you two turns. This would allow you to uh, get him charged up in one turn. And let's say you don't have the double dragon, or let's say you don't have a double colorless. You can attach for turn. Let's say you have one energy. So, uh, uh, let's say, I'm sorry, let's say you have one regular energy and then two more in your hand, you attach for turn, play the two energy cards from your hand, and then the following turn, attach again, and you're still charging Giratina EX up in basically one turn. So uh, this right here, this card has a lot of potential. It's the first energy accelerator for psychic types that we've seen in a long time. This is also going to help psychics tremendously. Uh, I actually can see Hoopa EX being possibly used now because you could actually charge him up in one turn. With Dimension Valley, Meowstic doesn't need an energy to attack. Hoopa, play the energy down and then two energy cards, uh, two more psychics on him and he's ready to go for the next turn. So. I don't know about you, but I'm kind of psyched about this card. I think this card has a lot of potential in the format, especially for psychic types. Now, the downside is, though, it does have to be from your hand. So, you know, getting two special energies in your hand is possible, but it's also going to be a lot more difficult. However, with Professor's Letter, getting two basic energies in your hand isn't as difficult. Uh, so, at least we can get two basic energies going. So anyway, guys, that's the crux of why I'm doing this video is because I really think this Meowstic will see some play, maybe even in competitive play. It's just, it's a, it's a really good energy accelerator. And the colorless energy is what makes it so special because then with Dimension Valley, it's using that energy acceleration for free. All right. But I do want to go through all these cards that are going to be in the Embora versus Togekiss deck. So let's look at Mawile. Uh, again, nothing special. 80 HP, Glare and Bite does 10 damage. And you have the potential to paralyze if you flip ahead. And then Snap Bite for 3 colorless can hit for 50 damage. So anyway, guys, that's pretty much all I have for you today on this uh, news update. Uh, hit like, subscribe. Put in the comments below how you would use Meowstic uh, from this set. And I'll talk to you later, guys. Bye.